Hey, I'm photographer David Bergman, and this is Two Minute Tips for Adorama TV. So if you've ever done a photo shoot with one of these pop-up reflectors, you've probably dealt with this incredibly frustrating issue, folding it back up. Today I'm going to show you how to tame these things and get them back down to size. Reflectors can be extremely useful on a photo shoot, and they come in all different shapes, sizes, and colors. They all generally work the same way in that they come in a really small bag and when you open them up, they automatically pop open to three or four times their original size. That's the easy part. After the shoot, you might find getting it back into the bag can be a challenge. You can push and shove this thing all day long and it's just not going to work. So how do you get that big reflector back into the little bag? I'm going to show you how. The first thing you want to do is hold the reflector out in front of you with both hands. Then take one hand and flip it over so that your knuckles are facing back towards your body. Then pull that hand up towards you so it twists the reflector into a figure eight shape. Now flip your other hand the opposite direction and you'll find that the whole thing curls up in on itself. All you have to do then is simply adjust the pieces so they're roughly the same size and boom, you're done. So at full speed, you simply reverse your hands and twist the reflector in on itself. Simple. Once you have this general motion embedded in your memory, you'll find there are a number of other products that use the same twisting motion. For example, Lastolite makes a softbox that opens up really big, but folds up the same way into a tight little bag. The only minor change is with things like these giant backdrops, because it's not in the shape of a perfect circle. What you want to do is fold it in half away from you first, and then you do that same twisting motion to fold it in on itself, and you're done. Get this technique down, and you'll have no problem folding these things up at the end of your next photo shoot. Thanks for joining me today on Adorama TV. Don't forget to subscribe for more amazing videos. Follow me on social media at David Bergman and go to the Adorama Learning Center for lots of other great tips and tricks.